tutorial, I'm going to make a quick and easy pumpkin for Halloween. Let's begin. First, let's start with deleting the cube. Now, shift A, mesh, and then let's add a UV sphere. Now, we can go to the bottom left and click on the arrow. And then we can change the segments to 24. Now, let's select the UV sphere and scale it up. Now, let's go tab to go to edit mode and then click on the top vertices. And then, oh, for proportional editing. And then, we can do G, Z and increase the mouse wheel to make it more effective. Now you can do the same on the bottom. After we've made it look squashed, we can do this. We can 2 to go to edge select mode and then we click Alt, Shift, and then we can select the loops. Make sure you leave one loop after we select the other. can go to proportional editing and click down on this and then we can click on random. Now we do S to scale and then we'll make it pumpkin looking. After we've done that we can carve out the eyes and the mouth. So in for Nelly and then go to edit and then auto mirror. Click on auto mirror and then what you do on the right you do on the left. Do K for the knife too. And then carve out some eyes. After you've done that, go to 3 to go to face select mode, select these two edges, select these two faces, and then delete. Now we can carve out the mouse. K for knife tool. And then we can start by doing coming here to the bottom or the top and then carving out the teeth. Do the opposite on the bottom. After you've done that, go to 3 to face select mode and select these faces. Go 
to excellent mode. And then to extreme here in the Z axis. Tab out. And then now we can go to the modifiers tab, add modifier, and add the bevel modifier. We can set the amount to a bit more and set the segments to about 12.
random so we can make it more natural. After we've done that, after we've selected the loops, we can go here and click on random. And then S. And then take the mouse wheel down. Now you can click L to now you can click L to select only this mesh and then you can scale it down. Selection. Tab out. Select this mesh and tap back in. Now we can make some loop cuts. So Control R, then make about four loop cuts. Now click L by selecting one edge and then clicking L. We can come here and then get rid of the mirror modifier. Now we can select this loop. Then you can do GZ. And remember to take proportional editing off. Select this loop, Alt, then GZ, GZ as well. Tap out, and then we can select the stem. Then go to the colors tab, and then we need to take new modifier, new new color, and tap back in. Select A to select all, new. Then we do the base color to green. Now we assign the color, and then we tap back out. Shift A, camera, and then click on camera. Now let's set up the camera position. Get a nice view and then control Alt numpad 0 to go to the camera selection. Nelly, and then we can go to view, camera to view. Have a nice angle on the top. Select the plane, scale it in the z-axis. And create, create a nice hook. After we've done that, deselect the camera to view. And now, Click on the area lights. Now we can change the color for this to a bit of a light blue. And this to a nice light red. Or pink. Thank you guys for watching this tutorial. See you next time.